Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Elena and today I am bringing you the first episode of the Family Dynamics Challenge, the new series I am starting here on my channel and I am so, so, so excited to be doing this challenge again because my goal for literally 2023 and just in general is to complete a generational challenge and this is honestly one that I've just really been wanting to do even though I didn't finish it the first time. I don't know, I feel like in a completely different mindset especially with with this sim and I know I honestly at the time loved Sylvia as much as I love Blair but it just feels different and I am in a better mindset in general so I just feel like I can put like everything into this let's play I just feel like I can do a lot with this challenge and kind of have just fun with it and I just want it to be chill and I don't want to stress about it too much so I'm super excited and before we get into like the rules and stuff if you aren't subscribed please subscribe literally like most of my viewers aren't subscribed it's free so just please subscribe it helps my channel so much and I would really really appreciate it also like this video and comment down below anything you would like so I'm just gonna get into the rules if you have already heard the rules you can go ahead and skip forward I will put a timestamp but if you want to hear the rules then I'm gonna read them right now so this challenge was actually created by Pastella Pixels and Standing Simmer so shout out to them for this amazing challenge but generation one is called white picket fence and it says from the time that you strike out on your own as a young adult you dream of cultivating loving familial relationships as rich and unique as the dishes you love to create you marry younger than some of your friends raise a bundle of children and enjoy gardening and entertaining in your free time spare time my bad yet you still devote a portion of your life to your hidden dream of becoming a master chef so our traits are outgoing foodie and family oriented um the aspiration is successful lineage and our career is in the culinary career um the rules for this generation are complete at least five gold level dinner parties master cooking and baking skills master or what marry a young adult wait marry as a young adult and sl why was i gonna say slay hold on marry as a young adult and stay happy happily married until death do us part, have three to four children, maintain a garden with at least 10 unique plants, including a cow plant, and complete at least three-fourths levels of aspiration. We are going to have a lot of fun with this challenge, like trust me. Okay, let me make sure my volume is up because I play with everything so low because I hate everything. So it is currently Tuesday. It's about to be 11 in the morning and Blair is actually standing outside. She's bored. She's, you know, looking at the trash cans, admiring them. And she was just praising Salem. But something I definitely want to do, I'm just going to like get this out because I'm probably going to forget is I want to get Salem spayed in this episode because Salem is fucking on one like literally screaming like wants to do the deed like you know what i mean like you know it's cuffing season for salem and she is not fucking around so what i heard that you talked down about my sc I, um no like why would you do that that's our best friend noel by the way like i'm gonna show you her house and since it's been so long i'm gonna do the house first and then we're gonna go to create a sip and we're gonna do all that but obviously like first episode tings you know how it is but i did a speed build on blair's house and there's some things i like you know like changed it's been like a month obviously like i can't resist but i will be uploading this version of the house as well so don't worry guys you will get this but i actually just merged a lot of my cc because my game was lagging a bit and i definitely wanted to do that before i started this series you see what i mean like salem relax okay so first things first is we are going to do a tour of the house so this is the living room i it I am in love with this house. Like, I know I say shit all the time. Like, I'm probably gonna start another Let's Play, like, one fucking day, and I'm gonna say the same thing, but no. Like, I- Usually, I feel like I get sick of shit, and I am not sick of this house. Like, I am so in love with everything and the way I did everything. Like, okay, like, I put cabinets there, and the wall is literally a half wall. Like, how was that gonna work? Like, that's the type of shit I'm talking about. Like, I changed it. But, yeah, I added this little corner over here with, like, some pillows and, like, a mirror. Like, literally so cute you um i just love the realism and i know some people are like this isn't realistic like your building is so ugly okay like literally like one person has said that but who just went into the bathroom um but like i think my building is fucking and beautiful so fuck off okay so we have like this little bar cart this is actually functional so like last time i had a whole bar outside and i'm like what like what like no like this is 
definitely way cuter and it's from ravishing then we have the little laundry area and then we go inside this is like ba we are pausing that because salem you are about to like die like i'm not even kidding we're gonna take salem right after i do all the introductions because that is how urgent this needs to happen because salem is literally on one but um the only thing i changed in here is i added this karomi rug this is all basically the same from when i did the video also there's no window in here ew sorry if this is like giving you a headache like i'm trying to be like oh my god i keep pressing random buttons like this is literally how it is when i play like i just like can't get a grip this is Blair's room obviously you guys know we have her little high school graduation picture because this bitch didn't go to college um but hopefully I'm not giving you guys a headache already because of the way I'm doing this tour I'm trying to be like aesthetic and cute and like cozy but maybe like that's just not meant for me but that's how I'm trying to be so but I'm gonna go into create a sim and I'm gonna show you guys all her outfits and i'm so excited i have my little holiday background if you guys want it it's on my tumblr no it's actually on my patreon like all the way at the bottom it was like my one of my first things i made i think but we have her everyday outfit so cute literally love her so much um i'm using different eyes like i'm proud of myself um so we have her everyday outfit let me back up and then we have her formal wear as you guys know i'm very like kind of not like boring when it comes to their outfits but also her outfits are giving very monochromatic like her outfits are very just simple and basic and i also posted this on my fucking instagram about how i get so much anxiety when things are clipping and i'm trying to get over that because i wanted to use this like jacket so bad and we're doing it guys we're literally doing it i have to be that way with like the ears too but like in real life my ears like clip with my hair so we're just gonna like relax on that um and this is gonna be my time Time to shine and get over my fear of being a perfectionist with that kind of stuff because it it it's a thing and it sucks but yeah salem's a girl i don't know why i was questioning whether or not she's a girl or not but this is salem so pretty and salem's traits are aloof curious and a prowler so love that for salem oh also i want to go over well her likes and dislikes are basically just like she likes everything that she needs to be good at like baking and cooking and stuff like that um but she's actually bisexual and but she honestly prefers women over men but like she could go both ways so she's a little bisexual queen and i have a love interest for her i actually have a list of things that i'm gonna do every episode and we're gonna i think start every episode by going over what i want to do to kind of keep me on track but i want you guys to meet blair i guess um but i also want to join a career so we're gonna do that really quick because that is the second thing on my list um i want to intro her friends and go to mcdonald's like okay and then i want to start a garden and the baking skill and that is all i'm going to say for right now i have a little thing we're going to do at the end of this um but you guys are going to have to wait and see so we are going to go into the culinary career and i actually have like a fun plan for her because i hold on we're gonna actually go over here and start making some drinks um just to um get started so i'm gonna have her oh i thought you could make water for free oh you can so we're gonna start making some water because that's actually free and it gets your skill up um so um i also okay i guess we're just gonna practice making drinks because that was so quick like what um I think my plan with Blair is I want her to have an in-home bakery or like an in-home wedding cake business because there are like some mods that you can do like in-home bakery. So maybe she can have like an in-home cafe or something like that. But also like Carl's dine out. The, dude, I'm gonna like kill Salem. Like after this, we're gonna head to the vet and we're gonna do that. That's not even on the itinerary, but I'm gonna break the itinerary because we have to because salem needs to relax but i think i want her to have like an in-home bakery like i think that would be super cute and obviously when we move to a baker house it'll be way easier to like do that but you know this is the first episode so we will get there um oh but i also went to the huber and hijinks festival so i wanted to sell these while we were in game together so you guys wouldn't think i'm just like giving her a bunch of money because i actually started her out with like a thousand maybe like 800 simoleons obviously after i like decorated everything but i wanted to go ahead and do that and she went to the humor and hijinks festival with her friend noelle so this is okay our mom is actually calling us so hold on hey blair 
Blair, I feel like trying something new and exciting, something like changing careers. What do you think? Um, you should follow your heart. This is actually our mom, Lori McKnight. Oh, and her last name is McKnight. So I guess this is the McKnight legacy, like so cool. But, um, but yeah, we will get into meeting everyone and we've already reached level two of the mixology skill, which is so good because we need that for our career anyway. Um, so this is her best friend, Noelle. Um, you know, they go back like friends in high school. She lives in San Myshuno in an apartment. This is her mom, Lori. She doesn't know her dad really because her mom actually like went through a sperm donor. And I know that's kind of like, I feel like she's supposed to have like a good upbringing, but... I guess like I don't know she's kind of just like I don't know like the thing about okay I okay who the fuck is about to walk up to our door I can see them um our mother and she is naked um I guess we'll invite her in like I kind of don't want to because she's literally like naked right now but that's my fault because I didn't give her any other outfits um so we're gonna change her outfit really quick but like her mom just like was kind of like a boss ass bitch and like she just like wanted to do it that way it's like nothing against anything she just like wanted to do it that way and also i just like don't really want to have like an elaborate backstory because i feel like that's when i get like very in my head if i'm not like following the backstory all you have to know is like she is pretty close with her mom um like kind of just like a normal relationship since she did just call us asking what she should do maybe she's having a midlife crisis or something yeah, so we'll give her a little sure. we'll give her a little love a little mm, wow blair oh i thought she was just gonna go in i'm like damn that's like a lot of love like you're really giving your mom like a lot of attention but yeah so then we have our best friend will and he is yeah, just our guy best friend. I mean, he's gay. So obviously, like, it's very platonic. Like, there's nothing there. Um, But yeah, so Will, I have... I have a I have a plan for Will like guys I have it all in my head but we're not being very elaborate like we're being very chill like chill vibes because like yeah but I think that's like it like I, I think I've like said everything obviously you guys know like her traits and stuff um she has like would be happy to have a child and that comes okay former cocaine addict no okay like she's not a cocaine addict anyway but honestly sorry mom i'm gonna ask her to leave because we're gonna leave right now and we're gonna take salem to get spayed um we're not gonna give her a house key like what how do i get you to leave here okay sent home oh she's like mom get the fuck out we have things to do like this is the first episode of the let's play like she's thinking about rockets like cool so we're gonna actually go take salem to get spayed i don't really want kittens or anything i can really only handle one pet so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna head to this lot this is by floral whims on tumblr literally i just want to talk about this really quick uh this is this is sim lissy save file but i went in on making every lot custom i'm gonna try and do every world but most of these are by floral whims um i think charmy something on what's it called tumblr sim lissy but you guys will get to see i have so many fun lots newcrest is like completely like redone with community lots because i'm so sick of like everything just being like residential lots when really like i'm only playing with one household so why do i need that many residential lots but floral whims is like my new favorite creator when it comes to gallery builds because their stuff is so realistic and i'm literally so excited to play in the save file now because of their build so shout out to them if you guys go on my tumblr and you just look up lots you'll be able to find their builds but i love them so this is actually a lot it has a vet a cafe and something else i think or i don't really remember so we're just gonna have to see but after this i'm probably gonna have um blair go out with her friends um and then also of course today i want to start her like baking and cooking skills and yeah we're just gonna we're just gonna vibe like okay so this is a lot oh it is a cinema a cafe i think i'm gonna put the walls up just to give it more like you guys know like separation but we have like the cafe and then we have the movie theater with the cinema like so cute so let's go in and let's sign in salem to get spayed because even right now like salem is literally freaking out like So she's gonna head over to the 
the cafe section of the, or maybe is there, oh, there's a library up here. Oh my God. We're going to head over to the library portion and we're just going to chill until Salem is done. Can we order groceries through the computer? I don't think so, but like, I really want to get groceries because I have the simple living lot tray on. I know like I am actually just destined to like explode because of that, because every time I do that, I literally explode, but let's just like look up recipe ideas. Why can't we do that? Hello. Look for new recipes. Okay, she's, look at the way she's walking. Like she is literally feeling herself, but we're just gonna like have fun, you know, shits and giggles looking up recipes. I've honestly kind of been in my, I'm gonna be like so honest with you guys. I've been in my low key comparison era where I just like see all these simmers and their cozy let's plays. And then I'm like, damn, like I know I shouldn't be thinking like this, but I'm like, damn, like am I too like annoying in my let's plays? Like, you know, you guys are probably like, no bitch. Like, no, I think about that sometimes, but I know like you guys watch me because I'm me, but it's a little hard sometimes. Where is Salem? Did... Is the procedure over or what? Oh. Oh, Salem's just chilling outside. Like, hello? Um... Salem? Congrats on landing that sweet job. Thank you so much, Noel. Like, I literally love you. Salem? Um... Salem? Um... Are you gonna get spayed or not? Nah? Like... Maybe he's in line. Possibly. Um, Salem? Hold on, let me go sign Salem in one more time. Maybe it just like fucked up. Like, I don't know. Okay, sit here then. Okay, not wicked. Sit here and like wait. And where is Salem? Like, get over here. Go get spayed. I can't do this anymore. Okay, wait, it's happening. I'm gonna have Blair just come over here and like sit here. Like we own the place. Like we're the vet. Oh my God, look at her. She's so cute. I literally keep thinking that Salem's a boy. Look at her. Oh, look at the cone. Oh my God, look at her ears. She's so cute. Oh my God, I'm literally crying. Look at Salem. She's so cute. Oh my God. Okay, uh, you're not gonna like go grab a serving of whatever the fuck that is. Like we're gonna go home. So I'm gonna head home and I'm not gonna go to McDonald's tonight. Like hell fucking no, because we're gonna be there for so long if we do that. But me and Salem are gonna head home. I'm probably just gonna have her make dinner and then we'll have like a little relaxing night. But I'm just gonna have Blair head in and we can go ahead and cook something. I don't think she has any cooking skill. Um, While I was, oh, okay, we have level two cooking. While we were just like chilling in the save before I started recording. Okay, I'm just gonna have her get leftovers because I did have her make some, um, I think smiley potato fries, but now we don't have any um, groceries. So after we eat, I'm gonna have her order some groceries so that we have obviously ingredients to cook. But the custom food I'm gonna be using in this Let's Play is just Granny's cookbook, literally my favorite. Um, but after that, we're gonna probably take a bath and then uh, maybe we'll call Noel on the phone or something. Possibly we can buy, um, oh my God, I keep saying um, like, um, possibly we can buy seeds on the, no, I don't think we can. We can't buy seeds. So maybe we'll go into Henford on Bagley and no, like we're not going to do that. Sorry. I'm literally just thinking aloud. I want her to buy seeds, obviously to start planting shit. So I don't know guys. <sighs> Like, we'll just play it by ear, obviously. So we're gonna have her use the bathroom and then let's take a bubble bath. We're gonna brush our teeth for the night. So while she's in the bath, I'm gonna order some groceries. I really should be like looking at... Wait a minute. Should we go on Social Bunny? I haven't played with Social Bunny yet. I know this is so random, but I want to add Noelle on Social Bunny and let's actually send Noelle a friendly message and let's send Will a funny message. Okay, so we can't post anything until we experience something. Um, We're in the bath right now. Like, what do you mean? We're experiencing everything we need to. But she said, the person who invented autocorrect died today. Restaurant in peace. Why is that actually funny? She's bringing out her like chef humor. Like, okay. She's, she's quirky and she's like a silly girl. Like we love her for that. Not Salem running amok outside. So I can actually have Salem like go and like look for stuff for us and bring back like 
I guess, gifts, which is like super cute. But most of the time, I just like having my pets be like independent because I don't know. I just only have time to like deal with my sim. You know what I mean? And I also don't have the selectable pets mod anymore because it was like broken. So I don't know if it's ever been updated, but I was wrong when I said we couldn't buy seeds. We can actually plant these, which is amazing. But okay, so what are we gonna get? Let's get some blackberries and blueberries. Let's get some milk. Um, we'll get two cheese. We'll get some cherries, a choco berry. We will get some eggs. So we can only get one egg. Like that's actually like insane. So I guess we'll get four eggs and then we'll get some flour, milk bread, We'll get a raspberry and we will get sugar for baking, obviously. And then we will get a wrapped red meat and a wrapped white meat. So that is all we're gonna get from the grocery store. Well, we're calling Instacart right now to get our groceries delivered. I don't think she can do that while she's bathing. So when she gets out of the bath, we're gonna do that. And I'm also gonna stop like fast forwarding a lot because usually I will fast forward like a lot when I'm playing. For the let's play to kind of just slow down, um, I'm gonna try not to do that. So we are just gonna move the laundry over to the dryer. Someone is at the door. So it is our grocery delivery. Okay, so our grocery delivery is here. Let's just go ahead and give them a tip because we are honestly like I usually wouldn't, but like in real life I do. So I'm just gonna like, but like this big ass coin, like not, it's like breaking the fucking immersion of like realism, like not that big ass coin. Okay, so the groceries are unloaded and it's 1.55 in the morning. So I'm probably just gonna have her head to sleep and then we can just like, make a cute little breakfast in the morning so i'm gonna have her head to sleep and then i will catch up with you guys wait a minute okay what i thought that everything from her side table deleted like what the fuck okay so we are gonna head to sleep and then i will catch up with you guys in the morning okay so blair is up it is 7 20 in the morning we are gonna take a quick shower we use the bathroom we're gonna brush our teeth and not our water like literally going rancid like Oh my god, look at Salem. Why is she alone in the dark like that? And it says wake up Salem, like she's not even sleeping. Um, But I know, I forgot to mention that I just put all her shit in here. Also, Salem hasn't used the litter box the whole time I have played. Like even before when I was like getting this let's play ready, Salem never used the litter box. I'm like, Salem, are you good? Like, is this another issue we need to bring to the vet? Because Salem, no, you are not about to drink that spoiled water. Like, what do you think you're literally doing? Let's go ahead and make some breakfast. Obviously, we're gonna use Granny's cookbook. Oh, I forgot that we like have a job. So I'm gonna have her just make some breakfast and let's make an acai bowl, make it very easy because we just need fruit. Okay, so I was like, let's just make an acai bowl because it's like super easy, even though like the fruit that she literally made to make the acai bowl is the fruit that I was gonna have her plant. But good thing we have all the time in the world with this let's play like i can just have her go to henford on bagley maybe and go to like the flower shop stand and get it from there that could be cute so she's just gonna watch some tv eat her acai bowl because then we have to head to work and then after work i'm probably gonna have her stop by her mom's house because her mom was like telling us about how she has this new neighbor and her name is sophia and that she's like really cute and like she honestly thinks that she'd be blair's type and blair's like really like you don't know what my type is but i don't know Lori thinks she knows what she's talking about so we're probably gonna have to head over there after and right now we're gonna head to work but then afterwards we're gonna head to our mom's house so i will get back to you guys when she gets home from work and also i'm gonna have her work hard because i want a promotion already Okay, so we did get a promotion. I'm so excited. That was like super easy, but I also think it's because I have some law traits, not like any crazy ones, but I'm gonna show you guys what law traits I have. Um, I have chef's kitchen, great soil, and homey. And then I have the simple living lot trait, obviously, but I think it's like helping her gain her skills faster. So that's always like a helpful tip, I guess, if you want to gain skills quicker, but that's all I have for her. And the fact that she like likes, what is she wearing on her feet? Okay, 
So Blair has been promoted to head dishwasher. She will now make an additional simoleon per hour for a grand total of 16 simoleons per hour. And we've also got 334 simoleons and the corporate chic countertop, which we're going to sell because that is so fugly. Like, so honestly, we have like quite a bit of money. Um, I don't think she has any bills or anything. Nope. So I'm going to have her head inside. We're going to shower and then we're going to head over to our mom's house because she was talking about that neighbor. And I think that Blair is going to probably... Oh my God, look at this fucking sink. Like that is actually so disgusting. We're gonna clean the sink first and then we're gonna brush our teeth again because Blair's honestly like very like, I guess not like super, I mean, I guess she's like anal about her teeth. I don't know. That's just like a quirk I'm literally giving her right now, like from the dome. So we're gonna do that. And then we are gonna go and probably make dinner at her mom's. I'm gonna see if I can get her the, I think we can, the always welcome because oh my god it's so nice oh yes it makes it so that like you know like they don't get mad at you when you're like cooking and stuff at their house which is like literally so annoying like why can't i cook food at my mom's house like how is that even like what oh my god is salem okay like salem who is this i'm called Oh my god. Okay, so we're not gonna do the whole marriage thing because I don't want to deal with it. My sim always gets tense. So I'm gonna say, um, under what conditions? And then we get 2,500 simoleons. Like, yes. So we're definitely gonna get her laptop. Salem, are you good? Like, oh my god. Like, empty the bowl. I feel so bad. And then fill the bowl. Let's, like, let out. Why did not the- <laughs> The way the cone just, like, fell off is- Oh, oh. I thought it meant let out of the house, not let out of the cone. Salem is in her depressed era because the cone was on and she literally was just sitting in her bed. Like she was literally just in bed because she was like so upset. But we're gonna grab a serving of milk bread and then we're gonna head over to our mom's house. Like what even is milk bread? I don't know, but it sounds really good. So she's thriving. She's so cute. Let's head to our mom's house now um she's feeling herself she's so confident so hopefully this goes well because if it doesn't that's not gonna be good but our mom does have a dog and his name is bear but bear is just standing outside like why are you just standing outside bear do a cautious introduction oh bear you need to relax like give a treat here you go come on treats make it better Oh, not there being a fire. Where is there a fire? Oh my God, Lori has this. Oh my God, our mom's like house is on fire. Like, go in. Um, let's extinguish it. Of course, like of course. She's like really like of course this would fucking happen. Like, mom, are you like actually stupid? And her mom just like running away. Okay, well, yeah, you got here right on time. Like, I literally already put it out. Like, fuck off. Like, literally fuck off. Like, what do I get for doing your job? Like, do I get any sort of compensation for the trauma that you just put me through? And then they're just gone. Like, great. So let's go knock on our mom's door and be like, mom, like, are you good? Like, oh, she's just like taking a bath. At this point, we're just gonna go in her kitchen and like start making shit because we just like don't have time to be like waiting around. It is 8.43, we don't wanna be like creepy and like go over to her house when it's like so dark. So we're gonna actually have her make some brownies and it sucks because I don't have Granny's cookbook over here so we can't make like a cute recipe, but hopefully these come out good because um, her baking skill is like not high at all. Okay, here's her mom. So we're just basically gonna be like, so I'm over here because you told me that you have like a new neighbor and like she, you think she's my type? And her mom's like, yes, like I told you that because I know it. Blair's like, okay, what the fuck is she doing? I know, she's like, get the fuck away from me. Like I'm trying to make brownies. Blair, hurry up, stop talking, focus. Oh my God, Lori, move, like literally move. Lori. Perfect. Oh my God, they look so good. Yes, look at these. <gasps> oh my God, they look so good. Okay, so put them in your inventory. And then we're gonna be like, wait, what house was it? Like, and she's like, the one across the street. Like, you won't miss it. Like, it's totally your style. Like, you will literally love it. And I think we're gonna just like give our mom a hug and then leave. Um, let's actually become best friends because she really is close with her mom. Like, she's all she's like ever had, even though her mom is like so annoying sometimes. Yeah. 
Like she literally is. I'm gonna let out Bear because it's making me so sad that he's just standing there. He needs to go pee. Go pee. Good boy. So this is the house that she is talking about. And this is also by Floral Whims. Um, the same person that made the vet. This is the house and it is definitely Blair's vibe. So we're going to go over and we're going to visit the residence and hopefully all goes well. Okay, so she is feeling very confident, which is good. We are here at the lot. This is it. It's a very big lot. We have the main house and then we have like a garage out here. Um, Very cute little swing set. And we're just going to head in. Literally, Blair has no idea like what to expect. She's kind of just going to pretend like she's also the neighbor because she's like, this is like kind of awkward. I'm just like knocking on this girl's house. Well, she doesn't know the girl yet. This is Sophia and this is the girl that her mom is like, Blair, she's a hundred percent your type. She's so cute. She seems so nice. So Blair is going to come over here and she's actually just going to introduce herself to um, Sophia and we're going to do a funny introduction because she's confident and Blair is pretty funny, so she feels like she could win her over with her sense of humor. So Hi, small. I'm Blair. Um, I live across the street. Oh, we seem to make her laugh. Uh, let's see what that is. Hopefully it's not too bad. Hopefully it's not something we can't work past. Okay, so Sophia thinks that we are an interesting sim and Blair thinks that she's clingy. Blair, are you like actually stupid? Like, what does that even mean? But let's get to know her. Let's ask about her day. And let's be like, it's kind of embarrassing, but my mom like told me to come over here and I made a like welcoming gift. I am, you know, like kind of a baker. And I just wanted to make you some brownies because, holy shit, what the f like, I made some brownies. I bake a little bit. No big deal. <gasps> okay, like, fuck. Let's ask about her day and, you know, tell her kind of what happened in our day. Cringe. I just need to express this uncomfortableness from a social buddy post. Aw. It was, no, it wasn't. Like, I don't care. Like, I'm getting rid of it. Okay, so I'm just gonna have her, like, keep talking to her and keep getting to know her. Um, let's discuss our stress mood. She's tense also, so maybe we can relate to her on that. Um, let's have a deep conversation. I don't know why. She's scared. Why? She's scared? Why? What is happening? But I think that went, like, kind of good. Um, let's actually add her on Social Bunny not her taking our joke let's actually do a new post and let's post about being back from work um we'll do a confident narrative because we got a promotion oh my god i just had her post about going to work on social bunny and she said wake up grind go home rest it's a steady routine and i'm totally crushing it that is so cringy I like don't even want to add sophia on social bunny at this point because of that post alone like blair don't ever post some shit like that again. But I'm gonna have her actually add Sophia on Social Bunny. And then maybe when we go home, we can like send her a text, you know? Or like tag her in something. But we're gonna go use her bathroom and then we're gonna head back home. And we're not gonna obviously hang around this house alone. But she also like doesn't live here by herself. This is kind of like her family's home um, and they're out of town. So obviously like I'm not gonna have her live here alone. But yeah, so let's just have Blair head home. I guess we can just call our mom when we get home and tell her how it went and be like, you know what, you were like right because she is like a hundred percent my type she seemed really stressed out but like i can definitely you know work my blair charm on her and i think it could work out but yeah sophia is so cute and i made her specifically for blair so like i think they're just gonna be so fucking cute and i'm excited i'm excited hopefully it goes well but i'm just gonna like give salem some love because salem has gone through it since the start of this let's play um so we're gonna give her a hug give her a treat just give her some love and then we're gonna head inside and 
Um, I guess she can have more milk bread if she wants or we can make dinner. So I forgot that we do have ingredients. So hopefully we can make something um, with the ingredients that we do have. I don't, okay, well we can make chicken and waffles, um, but I don't think that's because we have the ingredients. I just think that's because we don't need ingredients for some reason. She is just gonna make her chicken and waffles and then we are gonna probably head to bed because it is very late and I think that she has work in the morning she does so we definitely need to do that but we also need to finish this so that's actually good that we are like cooking right now oh my god and we already reached level three of the cooking skill which is so good like i feel like last time i reached level three in the first episode which is crazy all right so that is where i'm gonna end this episode i hope you guys enjoyed i really enjoyed playing and i just am so excited to have a chill and fun let's play on this channel um definitely comment down below anything you would like give this video a like share it it helps me a lot also don't forget to subscribe if this is your first video you are seeing of mine and if it is i'm so happy you made it to the end and i hope you enjoyed so i hope you guys are having a good night or day wherever you are and i will see you guys in my next video Bye, guys.